What if I told you the picture on the left is NBA 2K21 and the picture on the right is NBA 2K20? Wait, I think it's the other way around. Wait. Gotcha, bitch! Green! Come on now, I'm not gonna go to the He's stuff! Rainy! Come on now. Bro, he's boxed. This is toxic, bro. Nah, bro. I just green that. Step back. Green! Oh my. What is good, YouTube? It's your boy Henry, aka Double HD, and I'm back in the building with yet another banger. Now, as you can tell by the thumbnail and the title, I'm going to be testing and using every single takeover in the NBA 2K21 prelude. Now, as you can also tell by the background gameplay, I've been messing around with a lot of dribbling, and I really like the dribbling this year. I think that's one of the rare W's 2K took with this prelude. We're gonna see how it is in the full game in about a week. But if you guys want to dribble tutorial, drop a like on the video right now. If we get enough likes, I'll drop a dribble tutorial. So let me know in the comments, do you guys think dribbling is, is nice this year? Because I really like the dribbling, I'm not gonna lie. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel because we got a lot of banger 2K21 videos on the way that you're not gonna wanna miss out on. Now before we get into the testing, I need you to pause the video right now and comment down below what takeover you think is gonna perform the best in the prelude or what takeover you're gonna be using. Just let me know in the comment section. But one more thing before we get into the video, I just got partnered on Twitch yesterday. Absolutely crazy. I appreciate all the support we have been getting on Twitch. Now, if you guys wanna see extra streams outside of my YouTube, cause I do stream on YouTube all the time. Now the reason to turn on notifications, make sure to follow my Twitch. The link will be in the pinned comment and in the description. But anyways, guys, without further ado, let's get straight into this bag. Banger, man. Let's get it. Now, by the way, I'm going to be using two controllers to make the speed a little faster to get takeover. So if you see just some random player on the other team just standing out of bounds, so that explains that. But anyways, let's test these takeovers, baby. All right, y'all, we have rim protector takeover. So we're going to test out and see what it's like to be guarded by someone with a rim protecting takeover. So let's get it. Oh, my God. This shit. And I remember, keep in mind, I got Bill Russell. I can barely back him down, bro. Nope. To... Yo! He's really going crazy. All right, back to Bill Russell. Now, obviously, rim protecting takeover is an offensive takeover or a defensive takeover. So I'm not going to be testing the offensive strengths on rim protecting takeover. But I mean, bro, this shit is looking. <laughs> oh my God! Chill out. All right, let's see. Nah, bro, that's literally never going in. Look at this shit is getting clamped, bro. Like, you literally cannot back down Shaq. Rim protecting takeover is looking like a W, bro. Very good defensively in the post. All right, y'all, we have sharp shooting takeover. We're about to see what this is like, bro. We're about to see what this is like. Can I fade? Is it like last year? Oh, my God. They're literally double to me, bro. All right, let's get it. Rain his eyes. Ooh, okay. 17% coverage. I don't know, bro. You, I feel like last year I'd be able to green that. No cap. Full bar. Bro, yeah. Bro, Sharp Take looking a little sus right now. I'm not going to lie to you. Come on, that's open. Green, there we go. 13%. I feel like it's just the new meter, bro. Like, I just got to get used to the new meter. I'm going to try to shoot from hella deep. Like, can I shoot from back here? Too deep. And he definitely has Hall of Fame. Um, He definitely has Hall of Fame rating center, bro. I'm going to shoot from hella deep right bro, here. Yeah. The hash. Dang, bro. Like, you really can't shoot from over there. Overall, I mean, sharpshooting takeover, I feel like I was just testing the range. I feel like it can't shoot as deep as it could last year. But, um, I think it's still going to be effective, bro. I mean, especially if you take your meter off. Oh, right, yeah, I have post-scoring takeover. I feel like this is going to be overpowered. Let's see. Let's try a post up. Oh, my God. I just... <laughs> All right, let's get it, yo. We got Kevin Garnett on uh, Kareem. That's a good defender. Let's see it. Let's see it, bro. Let's see if we can just literally get him out. Oh, oh hell my... no. Why is this still OP, bro? Are we serious? And y'all got to think about it, bro. Like, that's literally Kevin Garnett. Like, we're talking about somebody with hella defensive badges. One of the best defenders of all time. Like, okay, post spins aren't really working too well. I'll try to post hook. I mean, those whites are going to go in every time, especially with the Kareem sky hook. I feel like depending on where you real, where you shoot your post hook, it's just going to be a full white every time, no matter what. Like, look at this, bro. Oh, my God. Look at hey, double yo, team green. <laughs> <laughs> we have Robert Parrish and KG on me, and I just green. Like, come on. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I really do think post scores are gonna be thriving this year, bro. Like, everyone's making these small center builds. Like, look at this, bro. 
Like, that, that's gonna go in every time. You know what I'm saying? Like, it doesn't matter if you green it or not. The thing is, bro, I just don't understand why they just don't patch this post-scoring takeover. Like, should it really be this OP? Y'all comment down below. What do you think about post-scoring takeover, bro? Let's look at this, bro. White, but it's post-scoring takeover. Post-fadeaways and post-hooks, bro. All their whites went in last year, and they're still going in this year. That's the thing they need to patch with these post-scores, bro. They need to patch this takeover, and they need to lower the white success rate with these post fadeaways and post hooks bro like, look at this bro i'm just look at he has me contested right and it still went in <laughs> i'm not gonna lie bro post scoring takeover is looking the most overpowered it really just is too godlike bro hey i have slashing takeover we're just gonna try to dunk on people bro let's let's get it come on oh wait green i just green that i'm not gonna lie slashing looking pretty promising after that dunk Right, let's get it. Let's try to hop step. Ooh, okay. Contest it, bro. I feel it with slashy tingler. It doesn't matter what you go up with. Like you're just gonna make it. Oh my god. Four seconds. I'm gonna dunk on him, bro. I'm gonna dunk. Alright, yo, bro. Let's give Paul George the ball back, bro. Because we're really trying to go crazy. I'm going baseline with it. I'm not gonna lie. We're forcing the baseline. Hey, okay. Oh nah. Blow by animations back. Let me find out. Oh, yeah, we on the break with it. Come on, Paul George. Dunk. Nope. What the? Slashing takeover ain't looking too bad. I feel like slashing might be one of the most overpowered takeovers low-key, but let's get to the next takeover. All right, y'all. I have playmaking takeover activated right now. I'm just going to try to spam snatchbacks and space careers. Oh, my God. Oh, we get... Yo, he is so... Magic Johnson is so fast, yo. I'm trying to break some ankles, though, yo. Come on. Oh, my God. I can't break no ankles. 2K. Can you not space creator anymore? This is bad, like, why can't I break this dude, bro? Green in his mouth? What the f- Yo, bro, if I don't- Look at me. Okay, I don't know why I'm stumbling with playmaker takeover. Come on now, 2K. Why is that a thing, yo? I should be able to dribble as long as I want. Yo, I'm not gonna lie. This is ass, yo. Oh my. I'm not gonna lie. Look at me stumbling with the ball with play take. Yo, and this is magic we talk about. I'm not gonna lie, bro. Play take is looking extremely sus. Hey, right, we have shot creating Taylor. I'm about to just start shooting some fades. Oh yeah, we going to the corner. Full bar. Yo, come on. I'm trying to break this dude's ankles. No space creator in his face. Full bar. Let's get it, man. Buckets. Bro, I wish I could break ankles with this space creator. Oh, we got Kawhi guarding us. Ooh, in his face. Come on, Chris Middleton. I need you to get in your bag, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Let's go. Come on. Hey. In your mouth. Green! Okay, yes, sir. Come on now, Chris. Hey. Okay. Off the screen. Pull up. White. Okay, we make it. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. It's looking better than Sharp Takeover. Hey, y'all. I have Glass Cleaning Takeover with Giannis, so I'm just gonna chuck up some shots. See if Giannis can get some boards. Okay, he's snagging. Go crazy, Giannis. I see you. It's going to show the little, um, for, I'm not controlling Giannis, but it will show, um, where the basketball lands. Um, if you guys didn't know. Or, oh, he going up and getting that one. He going up and getting that one. I'm not going to lie. Giannis is a big body. Look at me just shooting stuff. Oh, he finally didn't get one. That's the first board he didn't get. And another thing is Giannis is like 6'11 in this game. So I feel like most centers are going to be like 6'9", 6'8". So they're going to have the vertical Giannis has. So to get up and get a board like he's doing right now. I'm not going to lie. So let's look at box, free board. It's looking, glass is looking pretty decent again. I think it's the best big man takeover besides post going. All right, y'all. We got lock takeover. So I'm really just about to try to, you know, I don't know, do something on Kobe. Kobe's got lock take. That's overpowered as heck. Now let's see. Okay, so he's picking up the ball. I mean, lock take looking like the same, bro. I mean, you could do that last year. But, oh, my God. That drained. You see how fast that drained my energy, chat? I said chat like I'm streaming. Oh, you can't hop step at all on that. I made that. See, I had lock take over last year, and I did notice sometimes it just wouldn't register like me sitting in front of the dude with lock take. So, I don't know. Let's just force it uh, I don't know. Lock take looking a little sus. Maybe it's just because it's the AI. All right, bro, I, I might have to just force a drive again. Like, lock take. Okay, it's picking up, though. It, it really does drain energy, and, um, like, look at how much energy I have, bro. Lock take is looking like it's just gonna drain your energy super fast. And, like, 
Look, I bump him. Look at half my energy gone just like that. Let's see if I can try to shoot. Yeah, it wasn't even really there in the beginning and he just contested it. Okay, you guys, I don't know what you think, but comment down below what you thought was the best takeover in this video. I think without a doubt, post scoring takeover, it's if anything, it's gotten more overpowered. I think playmaking takeover was the biggest disappointment. If it's that bad in the actual game, it's gonna be the worst takeover. Shot and sharp looking a little sus, but I think it's just because of the meter. But anyways, guys, if this video helped you out at all, if you enjoyed this video at all, make sure to drop a like for your boy and subscribe to the channel. Why not? It's literally a click of a button we're gonna be going crazy in 2k21 but anyways guys it's been your boy henry ak double hdf man and i'm out y'all i ain't never had no friends i was all alone she ain't never called my phone she left me on my own they saying all girls are the same brother than my dog she said can you stay with me now i got go. diamond dripping off my deck is wet i'm about to flex up on my necks